Deputy Governor Philip Shaibu was allegedly bared by Governor Obaseki's security detail from attending a party meeting at the governor's residence as claimed by former Edo State Communication Commissioner Emwanta Adazi. He told Channel TV that Philip Shaibu was not initially invited to the conference despite his help in the PDP candidate's victory at the Federal Courts and Supreme Courts. He added that a meeting was held at the governor's home to address issues raised by various government agencies for starters. The deputy governor wasn't invited to the meeting once upon a time. The deputy governor and I were in charge of coordinating all PDP candidate files with the Federal Court and the Supreme Courts. Considering his status, he ought to have been invited to the conference. The governor's security rudely turned away the deputy governor when he arrived at his house to speak with Tobasaki. After a day of persecution, the deputy governor went home to escape. My viewers at home, what was your reaction to this? Uh, please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section. Augustine Ogaji here did comment uh, saying, I uh, do not be Lagos. How far? He shook you. Didn't we want Philip Shaibu that Tobaseki betrayed his benefactor Adam Soshomole and he, he, Philip, was riding on the back of a tiger by way of supporting and joining forces to fight Soshomole? How far? Philip Shaibu was and still a comrade ought follow the part of the pathway of Oshomole. He blatantly refused. He followed blindly to his waterloo. Dear Philip Shaibu, carry your cross. Okay, then a sent a TV here. Uh, reply to Augustine Ogaji saying uh, the problem was that a Sako man Adam Oshomole ruled for eight years. Bini man Godwin Obaseki ruled for eight years and it's the turn of Essan Central man and Philip Shaibu and a Sako man from Adam Oshomole still wants to be governor. You mean you have no competent Essan central man for governor too? Philip Shaibu is an ungrateful Essako man. Very stupid individual. Okay. Have you asked at all your reaction to this? Uh, Sumaila Momo here replied to Augustine Ogaji and he says, uh, Okay, and it says that uh, Essan people are like Igbo men, they are very cheap to buy over. They will even fight their, their selves for strangers for a cup of beer. Okay, this is according to Samaila Momo to send a TV. Then uh, another comment is here from. Uh, Nike Dede tall man uh, uh, reacting to Sumaila Momo uh, here he says uh, trouble they sleep Yanga they wake up Sumaila please let sleeping dog lie you have no reason to involve the Igbo man in your discussion okay Sly here to Nike Dede tall man says uh, Mugu wish Ishan man, you know, like that. Cover your mouth, Mumu. Okay. Let's move forward, please. Sammy Sam says, uh, Mr. Philip Shaibu, you have you have beginning to learn your lesson. You betrayed Oshomole because of Obaseki. Now it's Obaseki turn to betray you. When Oshomole said Obaseki is a betrayer, you disagree with him. Now, how market she to Oluwa Shegun here to 
uh, to Sami Sam says uh, even Wiki apologized to Shomole that he was sorry because of the way he behaved to him in respect of Obaseke. Okay. Then uh, Sami Sam to Saintly uh, TV here says uh, actually is a ton of Edo Saint. Okay, I think we have taken this before. And uh, let's move forward, please. Then uh, guest here yes, says a uh, very good for him. I wish him more of that. Well done, Obaseki. And uh, we have more reactions here. Another reaction here from Udility Unwajefe says uh, the military should take over governance in Nigeria. So that all these kind of useless politicians that call themselves governor can be stoned to death. Kayode Isaac Kehimi here says uh, Edo not be Lagos law. Access business says uh, Edo people should apologize to Oshomole. Emmanuel Akerele says uh, we Obaseki always fight with people around him. Something is wrong with him. Lawrence Shime says that uh, Osho Baba is always alive. Timothy Mbang says that uh, I think Obaski has the history of not uh, being able to walk anybody to a logical conclusion. Remember the issue he has with the lawmakers, his former boss. Osho Mule, how many will you count? Okay. Fulani Princess here says that uh, good for him. When he joined forces with the same governor to betray Adam Tushumule, whom God used to uplift them both, betrayers, backstabbers will never end well. Henry Oviawe here says, uh, Barely a year from now, Obaseki will leave office. He has uttered this regard to everyone in Edo State including those who helped him when he most needed them. May we never elect our hands a governor like Obaseki again. Say, may we never elect with our hands a governor like Obaseki again. Okay. Then, uh, guest here, uh, or, or rather PQ, uh, replied to Henry saying, uh, I do not be Lagos. Then another here from Steve Ofuri says, uh, How far, Philip? Ogunta, the Israel, Majojo says, uh, The problem with Nigeria deputies is that they don't wait for their time as they rub shoulders with their leaders and they pay dearly for it. If I'm Shaibu, I would play along with my governor until. I get what I need. And this is all can take for now. Thanks so much for listening. Sure you subscribe to our channel, share the report across on this platform. So bye for now. Stay for more broadcast. Thanks so much for listening. Bye for now.